Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in. My name is David and welcome to my YouTube channel. So today, we're going to talk about something that's very special to me, something that's very near and dear to my heart, Archie. Alright, Archie Comics. So if you've been on my YouTube channel for a while, you know that I'm a huge fan of Archie Comics. I do have several videos on my channel talking about Archie. Two of them show off my huge collections of Archie's stuff. So today is kind of a historic day in the world of Archie. They've announced this issue months ago. We knew it was coming, we knew what's going to happen, we just don't know how. Ladies and gentlemen, what you see before you is issue number 36 of Life with Archie. The supposedly second to the last issue in this particular series. And uh, in this issue, we see how our beloved Archie Andrews, the American icon, dies. Yes, this is the death of Archie comic book. Now, it doesn't matter what future you chose for Archie. FYI, Archie has always had these uh, alternate timelines and what-if stories. Like, there's a future where he marries Betty, and there's another future where he marries Veronica. No matter who he marries, the ending is the same for both timelines. Okay? So for those of you who don't know what I'm talking about, um, here's a random issue that best illustrates this. In every issue of Life with Archie, The Married Life, we see two main storylines. One of those where he marries Veronica, the posh rich girl with an attitude, and another story where he marries Betty, the sweet girl next door. So if you remember, both stories started here in single issues. I have the very first issue right here. So there are six issues in all, three that set up his life with Veronica and three that set up his life with Betty. And uh, the life with Archie storyline continues on from this. And you can choose to read one of the stories or both. Or, <laughs> or you can choose this as his future. <laughs> oh my gosh, remember, the, remember this monstrosity? Uh, I bet for a lot of you younger people, you have no idea what this is. This is a live action TV movie. This is a VHS. This is what we used to watch movies on before DVDs came along. Whoops. Uh, it aired on TV on my fourth birthday on NBC. And it tells the story of the characters returning 15 years after graduation for their high school reunion. And, dear lord, have they have interesting stories. Um, like, Betty has an abusive boyfriend in this movie. Veronica married and divorced, like, four different men. And uh, Jughead's a doctor, out of all things. Uh, and Archie is still Archie. He's still dating and being Archie, you know. Um, so if you're interested, this movie is on YouTube. The whole hour and a half is available online. Now, we're not going to talk about this. We're going to talk about... Life with Archie, number 36. All right, so I have uh, four of the five variant covers here. In the last issue, issue number 35 of Life with Archie, we actually saw all the, all, all the, uh, the, the, the variant covers for this particular issue. So there's going to be two, two comics in this storyline. One will come out this week, one will come out next week. All right, so I have five, uh, four of the five covers here. I got the one from uh, Frank Avila. I got Staples, I got Perez, and I got Hughes, but I don't have all reds. I don't have this cover right here. All right, so this one's missing. So uh, let's go through them real quick. And probably next week, I'll probably talk about issue number 37. Let's go ahead and pan right through here. And also coming out next week will be this uh, collected issue. So this will be like a magazine size with this particular cover. So look forward to that on your shelves next week. All right. And congratulations to Jughead, by the way. He got married last issue. So there it is. Um, the first issue that I have here is probably my favorite one. It's the most cheerful. And all the characters are there, sitting around the table. Uh, we see uh, Archie's um, coat right there on an empty seat. It looks like they're just sharing memories, sharing the, all, all the good times together, you know, and stuff like that. So we see Veronica and Betty. We see Cheryl, Reggie, Jughead right there, Moose in the background. <laughs> Very reminiscent of Life magazine, so very nice. All right. Uh, the next one we have here is a little bit more sadder. It has Betty and Veronica. Now, if you know the iconic picture of Betty and Veronica and Archie sharing the milkshake, this one. Look at them. No one's no one's sharing the soda. Okay, like empty seat and right in the middle. So that's pretty sad. Okay, it's, this is a beautiful cover, by the way. I love this cover. Um, they're all the same issues, have different different cover art. Now you all know. That Archie and his friends have the front, uh, have a, have a band called the Archies. Apparently, yeah, this one's pretty sad. The spotlight is shining on nothing but his guitar. So uh, there, there's another 
alternate cover for the same same issue. All right. And this one's the most depressing of all. Look at that. It's all dark and gloomy. It's all rainy. And down here, rest in peace, Archie Andrews. Everyone's under an umbre uh, umbrella, sing, standing around his grave, gravestone. Now, in the back of the issue, you can see here, you can, you can pause and read this. I don't have time to read it for you. But it is, it does tell you, this is the death of Archie issue. All right. He's going to save a life of a friend. Now, <laughs> I don't know why they did this, but a few days ago, they actually announced who was he's going to take a bullet for. And it turned out to be Kevin Keller. The, uh, the, the Riverdale's, um, Archie's gay best friend, okay? It's like uh, Archie's pal. Um, I have here the hardcover edition of Kevin Keller. And it does include the first ever appearance of Kevin. All right? So, Kevin gets the... Uh, he, there, there's an assassination attempt on Kevin, and uh, Archie took a bullet for him. That's how he died, okay? That's not a spoiler. Well, that is a spoiler, but they, they, they spoiled it for literally everyone on the, on the news. Like, Entertainment Weekly spoiled it for everyone, you know? They had a, 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 an issue talking about that. Now, you're probably wondering, what, what's next, you know? Life with Archie is over. <laughs> After Life with Archie. You guys are just waiting for me to say that, huh? Uh, Archie fans are probably saying, oh, after Life with Archie, uh, I bet he's going to make a joke about that in this issue, because Life with Archie's over. So, uh, yeah, there, there it is. Uh, zombies, whatever, you know. Um, for those of you, this is not the end of Archie. They're not, they're not going to stop Archie comics about to get whatsoever. Um, we're, we're still going to see him in his teen years. You know, those stories will continue to move on. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm collecting a lot of the Digest issues, all right? Those, uh... Those joke books and whatever, they'll, they'll still be around, okay? Archie's going to still be around, but we, but we, we now know how, how his character will die. And it's pretty sad, you know? I, I, I don't want the story to happen. He, he might, I don't know why he decided to do this. And if you have read this issue, this gets really political. Like, they talk about gun control and stuff like that. And, uh, you know, anyone who wants to read this comic will read this comic. I want to show you, like, the last... Last few covers, okay, the last few uh, panels of, of the comic. There it says, I've always loved you. Both girls crying over his body. All right. There it is, everyone. I mean, I, I actually shed a tear reading this, okay. It is a good book. And then you see in the back right here, The Death of Archie, an American icon, the beginning. It has a little story about his history and stuff like that. Oh, there, there is the... Uh, that's why I was talking about the, the picture. I mean, this is a different picture than what I'm used to, but uh, yeah, there it is. Next you, next week, okay? One year later, we'll talk. We'll see. I will probably won't make an issue. I probably won't talk about that. And I probably won't pick up all the variant covers any, uh, either. Uh, Alex Ross, we know him drawing like uh, the Justice League and stuff like that. I may not pick up this issue. I don't know. I like this one, and I like this one. And I will pick up the magazine size one, the one the this one, all right. But uh, I don't know. I mean, look at this, right? I I, I took all, all the issues. Why not? I might as well buy all the bearing covers. Um, one of my friends actually uh, said that this, these maybe cost a lot maybe in ten years. I don't know about that. Maybe the bearing covers. But uh, yeah, um, it's sad to see Archie go. Um, he's like. A best friend growing up, you know, I, I started reading Archie when I was like in uh, like 11th grade, you know, late high school, early, early college. And then he's, he, you know, he was like my favorite character in comic books. You know, I, I read Archie more than I do like Spider-Man or Superman and, you know, stuff like that. Um, so, yeah, it's uh, it's, it's kind of sad to see Archie go. What do you think about it? OK, um, what are your thoughts on the whole death of Archie storyline? Do you do you love it? Do you hate it? You know, is it a move forward? It's like it's like oh, should they never have done it, you know? So uh, comment below and let me know your thoughts. OK, so thank you for watching, people. Rate, favorite and subscribe. I will probably make another Archie collection video sometime in the future. You know, the last one was probably like a year old. So um, thank you for watching. I'll talk guys later. OK. Bye.